What's good, babes? And welcome back to Black Tea. It's your girl, Ebony. And you guys already know that your girl is back with the mess. So let's talk about Little Nas X coming out to basically respond to the haters and to also say, look, there are a lot of more things important besides my pregnancy. So you guys know a couple of days ago, this is when Little Nas X basically announced the release of his album Montero. But unfortunately, it wouldn't be an announcement without Little Nas X causing some controversy. Now this is what he had to say. Surprise! I can't believe I'm finally announcing this. My little bundle of joy, Montero, is due September 17th. Now he also went as far to troll and post a picture of an ultrasound. After Little Nas X did post on Twitter, this is when People Magazine released that he was on the cover of their magazine also flaunting his pregnancy belly and this sent Twitter into a firestorm causing people to not only come after Little Nas X but to also say that he's a bad influence. One Twitter user said I really am tired of Little Nas X. His ugly butt is too much. Effing roach. Little Nas X says you really on here calling a young mother to be ugly? A person then responds Dr. Umar said they will use the LGBTQ to distract us from civil black rights. They then birth Little Nas X, who is just a puppet for whatever label he signs to. Little Nas says, oh yes, man, the greatest threat to black civil rights. Niggas be like, you desperate for attention, then proceed to give it to me. A person says, Little Nas X goes from one outlandish antic to the next. You will never see a white, Asian, Hispanic, or Arab equivalent to him in the entertainment industry. Little Nas says, one day y'all will learn I am not a representation of anyone but myself. He continues with this, if I take ish on myself, am I gonna have kids wanting to ish in their pants? Let me get offline. All this negative energy is not good for the baby. The world is funny AF man. The government taking away women's rights. People are losing their homes to hurricanes and tornadoes and y'all decided a pregnant pop rapper was the worst thing happening now? I performed at one elementary school for free three years ago and y'all will never let that ish go. I kissed one man on TV once but since y'all are the H word y'all been equating it to SEX ever since. Stop using your little booger nose kids as shields. Hate gay people with your chest. I'm up at 9 a.m. arguing with people on Twitter and I can't find my prenatals and I'm getting cramps from this baby. This is not my day. Now after these series of tweets little Nas X did take a break, but he came back a couple hours ago to say, oh my gosh, I'm trying not to cry. Thank you for the early baby shower gift, Barack Obama. And this sent people into another frenzy saying that Little Nas X is doing too much online. Now, Little Nas X about an hour ago decided to respond to the haters yet again and also had some support from Jack Harlow in his comments. He started with this, y'all mad at me being pregnant but silent on the fact that John Wilkes Booth shot Abraham Lincoln. A person says, y'all mad at him for being pregnant but silent on the fact that Mr. Krabs sold Spongebob for 68 cents. Now Jack Harlow did respond and he said, I'm glad someone said something. So as you see, Little Nas X is not here for the backlash and I kind of want to ask you guys what you feel about this situation. We know that Little Nas X is a troll. That's what he does. But do you believe that some of his antics do have a bad influence on the culture? I want to know what you guys think about this topic down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. I love you to the moon and back and we'll definitely talk later. Bye babes.